Hello my lovely people, you're welcome back to my channel. I greet you according to your time and according to the time you are seeing this video. How are you doing? I hope you are good. We are still on the gist from the Palace of Oni of Ife. Happy Sunday to you all. I want to wish you a great Sunday. I hope your Sunday has been okay and you are enjoying yourself. So the alleged information reaching us right now is that we know me finally reviewed why and the truth she left the palace of a fake kingdom my people hey if you have been following this gist you know that every day we used to uh, some people used to say that this is the reason why we normally left the palace tomorrow you will hear another reason although the reason may not be concluded in one video because tomorrow another of the reason why she left will be reviewed as she keeps speaking and going to programs, I'm saying, uh, using her life as, a, as an example, you will continue to hear why she left the palace. So for those of, people, uh, those of you that watched the video she did in Singapore, because according to what we heard, we heard that she's still in Singapore, as I'm talking to you right now. And there was this video that she made. I did not have the video playing right here. But in that video, she said a lot of things. And why she left the palace of Ilefe Kingdom. According to some of the things she said in that video, eh, she said that a woman needs someone who can stand by her. You see? But it's, it's true now. A woman needs someone who can stand by her, who can assist her in, em, in everything. Because, you know, women, we women, uh, according to the Bible, we. Uh, Women are created out of one rib from the man. So, as she continued to say, in fact, she said that being a woman is a gift. It's a gift from God. And it's not easy to be a woman. And for the fact that you are now a woman, you have a lot of responsibilities. You have a lot of things that await you. And those responsibilities are why God made you the woman you are. Even as a girl child, uh, starting from a girl child to grown-up woman, you know, that there are a lot of things you are supposed to be doing for God. And for you to do this, you have uh, God, you need someone that will help you. And she, as she was uh, uh, illustrating what she was saying, she said that even those women and those girls in the village that is stickingly poor, they need assistance. They need someone who will come down to their level to help them and assist them in whatever they are doing. For example, if a woman goes to a farm and comes back and finds out that there's no one there to help her, it is not going to be easy for her. So from all these things that she has been saying, using poor people and the assistance and all of that that and that a woman needs help you find out that when she was in that palace and the started marrying all this wife that she that, uh, only of started marrying the women that she, he was marrying and the only of his face sisters too they were looking at her from that that they were looking at her as someone that did not come from a rich family or she doesn't have name uh, you know, because according to what we heard, Olori Mary and them, Lauren Kedem, they used to spoil only of his sisters with money. And Queen Nomi was not able to do that. So they were looking at her. And that, I can see that that, that was why only of his did not take his time to stand by Queen Nomi. Because from this thing that she said now, it means that while she was in that palace and facing a lot, a lot of things that she was facing, a lot of problem, a lot of maltreatment from people and the side talk. Considering the fact that she's still a young girl when Onyefe married her. And Onyefe was not able to stand by her. Which what I'm, this is what I'm understanding from all the things that she has been saying. As a young woman, you need help. And when you find out that the help is not coming from where you expect it, uh, it's, it's somehow discouraging. Yes? And that was why, I think that was why she left the palace. 
because Onyofe was not able to fight for her when she needed him to fight for her. As your husband, even a man that marries a woman, it, it, got to, it, it may go to a point that the woman will need your help to fight for her and you will not be able to do it because of uh, 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 maybe you are too busy with one nonsense or the other or you are too busy with one one or other side chicks that is distracting you you see i think that this these are the, some of the reasons why queen nomi left the palace so it's not just because only of started marrying women because had it been only of uh, was marrying these women and still have uh, 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 queen nomi's full time he fights for Kunomi even when her, his sister started uh, abusing her and uh, seeing her as nothing in that palace. That only if he was able to fight for her, assist her, stand by her. You know, we women, we need uh, uh, to look our face. If your husband is not looking at your face and uh, there are a lot of things that, that you expect from your husband and you are not getting it, I think you are not going to be happy. So Kunomi has found out that there is... Uh, if she continues to stay in that palace, the purpose of God in her life may not become to uh, will not be actualized. And considering what she said, oh, look at what she said. She said that uh, when she conceived, uh, when she wanted to conceive, uh, when she conceived that day, that there is this promise that he made to that she made to God. You see, that promise that she that she made to God, I think it's best known to her and. If you, if you watch that video in full, you will see why that is the main thing. You will see the promise that she made to God. And for her to continue to stay in that palace, I think the promise may not be actualized. You may not, she may not be able to keep to that promise. Because staying in a place where you are not happy, you are not going to be doing a lot of things you are supposed to do. And those things, those distractions there in that palace will hinder you from doing what God wants you to do. That is why she left the palace. Because when she was saying, when she was talking to those women she was talking to in that uh, video in uh, Singapore, uh, she was like, I know that you people will start saying that I'm teaching you why I left the palace and, and why I left, the, I left my husband. She started saying the reasons why she left. That it's not just that because she wants to leave, that because of the promise she made to God and other things, that was why she left the palace. So my people, look, hey, don't judge anybody from afar. Don't judge anybody from afar. You get why, why something they happen. Yes, Queen Nomi's own is a very good example. If you sit down and watch that video very well, you will, you will learn a lot of things. And again, it's not good for one to stay in a place where he or she is not happy. Happiness is the key to life. Thank you so much for listening. I know that uh, I just hope you go to this have uh, Instagram and watch that video. Watch it. You will learn a lot of things. Bye.